and welcome to this special live here on the social group and meetup group. Share this wherever possible. This is probably going to go out on the touring with us. Um, I don't know if this place is part of East Anglia. It might be on the outskirts, but we are in Hitchin here. Um, I'm hitching to get going here. And of course, I've got to literally find the spoons. Once I find the spoons, I will end this stream, okay? I'm just outside the car park, which is literally just behind me. I've literally had to walk 40 minutes to get here from the train station, and I might have to walk that way back. Um, it's the first time I've ever walked from a train station to an actual high street town, which is probably in this direction. I've searched it up on Google Map, just in case you're wondering. But yeah, I've got guidance with me, and of course, yeah, I searched it all up, and uh, I got a pretty much good idea uh, with help. Um, finding the location. I'm going to head up towards the church, which is in this direction here. It's a beautiful spot, by the way. And uh, yeah, I'll take the cameras around here. Looks like a lovely riverside here, just in case you're wondering here. And uh, just in case you're wondering where I am, I'm heading towards St. Mary's Church, which is just over there in the distance. And hello to anyone watching right now. It's a lovely, gorgeous day down here, here in Hitchin, just not too far away from Stevenage and Hatfield and of course the train goes on to King's Cross and that is the train that I caught from Cambridge but yeah some lovely little ducklings around here it's just beautiful everyone's having a good picnic over there look at that wall it's just amazing to see this wall and everyone enjoying a nice little breeze by the river here and you probably get a nice breeze from the fountain which is just literally over there so I'm gonna to head to the right here and uh, thank you very much for joining us by the way this is the old wall of the church here beautiful reflections of the river there people even having a picnic I've never seen that before can't really see it because of the big bushes but you saw it a minute ago that, of course, I would say um, they were having a picnic on a lawn of a church. So how fascinating is that? I'm going to head towards this way to find the spoons, which is in this direction. Now, the name of the spoons is called the Angel Vaults here in Hitchin. And uh, if you are new to touring with us, because this is going out on touring with us as well as the social group and meet our group, then, of course, massive hello to you and make sure you subscribe to Touring With Us. I feel very confident in doing this. It's very spacious. You can see everyone on the green just literally outside the church, which is hiding behind the trees here. It's St Mary's Church. I've got to go around. And look at the courtyard. It's just amazing, isn't it? Lovely, beautiful trees. So broadcasting live on... Facebook and on touring with us and uh, keep that thumbs up going please help support all the channels that I do I've literally got to walk back the opposite direction through the car park and then turn left across the traffic lights it takes about 40 minutes to walk it hopefully I'll be able to have a bite to eat after the end of the stream because I actually deserve it especially 23 degrees heat here you can see the main church that's for anyone interested in churches such as julian spoons of course uh, all the festivals are here hitching festival just in case all the events in july at st mary there can you see that julian <laughs> or anybody else that is interested of course lunchtime concerts soprano voice um, I can't see any organ recitals. They're all piano recitals at the moment, all three. Uh, so there you go, they all do piano kind of things, flute and cello, that kind of stuff. So that's your information there. And that's what's happening in July. It might be updated the next month. For further details, of course, you can view that website. So that's what the church looks like. I don't know what the manuals is inside. In other words, keyboards, how many keyboards they've got, but Julian will have to find out because he's an expert on organs. And any other organist that possibly is listening to this, you can 
see what the church is like itself. This is the main graveyard here of St Mary's here in Hitchin. It's come, well, I would say it's a quite an unusual uh, church to be honest with you. I do like those crosses on, on the tower there. Three of them in total. There you go, and the view of the spire. I do like these kind of historic churches because they look like castles, don't they? <laughs> it's amazing. So, hello, uh, Strawberry. So, yeah, just in case you're wondering where we are, we are in Hitchin, which is on the way to London. So, yeah, I've literally had to walk about 40 minutes from the train station. I have to go this way. And, uh, of course, this is the main church here. Did you like the crosses on the church here? Very much Christian kind. There you go. Yeah, I thought I'd show that to the audience. And, of course, I will go around it, but, of course, I want to have a bite of eat or bite to eat. And, uh, of course, you've got all these events here. Hitchin Chamber Orchestra, Saturday 9th of July, 7.30pm, St Mary's Church in Hitchin. So all the details are on that board just there. So, yeah, I just showed you that a minute ago. And, uh, of course, La La Land, Pink Panther. Never heard that uh, for a long time. Yeah, I do know the tune. Da -dun, da -dun, da -dun, da -dun, you know, that one, if it is that one. But, yeah, let's walk through to this high street here. And uh, thank you very much for tuning in and spotting us. <laughs> and uh, I hope to be able to get a chance to uh, chat to everyone at half past six. We'll see how it goes. Nice little birdie. Let's follow it. <laughs> it's probably running away from me. Oh, look at that. <laughs> oh, it's flown away. <laughs> so, yeah, we're coming into the high street now. <clears throat> and I'm going to do a sharp left turn. So I've searched this up and I do know where I'm going. Well, I hope so anyway. <laughs> and uh, of course, going back from the other side of the church, that's why I want to carry on because you'll see most of the other side of the church anyway. And then coming onto the high street here, as you can clearly see, I'm showing people how to use the camera in a straight mode, in a landscape mode and this is how you do it without the gimbal <laughs> i would use the gimbal but of course just can't be bothered to get it out in case the camera falls over but yep that's one of the gates there to so st mary's church <laughs> so there you go all we're seeing is bushes at the moment it's not all that exciting, but of course the other side of the church and a bit of the moon in the back distance there. Can you see the moon from here? So I'm going to have to keep talking because of the music being playing here. So, yeah, do tell us what the signal's like as well. We'd like to hear from people that, uh, of course, can see if the signal's working well. Hairdressing company here. Is it a place where you take your partner? That is the question that I'd ask. Certainly if I had one, I'd be taking them down here. It's quite a nice little marvellous place to come. Outside seating, just here. And some more here. And a beautiful view of the church. Look at that, amazing. Look at the clock on that. <laughs> no, I'm not in Peterborough. <laughs> Just in case you're wondering. No. <laughs> Far from Peterborough. <laughs> Does that look like Peterborough Church to you? This is a place called Hitchin. All those people that we will remember, loads of names to remember, come over here to check them all out. It'll take you all day to read it, I think. So there you go. This gives away where I am right now. Okay, there you go, St Mary's Hitching. So there you go, we're hitching mad here. You can see how beautiful the church is, just like that. <laughs> Get fantastic views from this side as well. 
because a lot of the time we were showing the bushes on the other side so it's nice to get a view of that and even on the moon over there can you see the moon just there wow <laughs> i think we need our binoculars out so we get a even better view of the moon so i'll step down here <laughs> step down yeah i think uh, a lot of members of parliament have done that today and uh the other days as well but never mind that yes yeah, it's a sad day for um boris fans i'm pretty gutted myself because you know we voted to leave the european union but never mind that we should move on we'll see what the next prime minister holds out for us so yeah we're going through the high street here the rosen crown here wow look at this amazing place definitely worth checking out so once I know where the church is, I literally just got to go right the way around to the car park and then head on to that way and then I'm not lost. I actually checked this out on the um, Google map. Oh, by me, it's quite hot around here. It actually is supposed to be 23 degrees, but it feels like it's more than that. So I have to be a bit careful in the sun. We've got a Starbucks coffee. Starbucks coffee, actually. Because lovely coffee is here. So, yeah, has Gabby Starbuck been in that? <laughs> you know the singer? We've walked with me, Tim. So, anyway, we should wander down here. We, we should see the sp spoons. I always think someone's shouting my name, but must be loads of people by the name of Nick, I have to say. So, yeah, hopefully I'm... Heading in the right direction here. This is the Church Gate Shopping Centre just here. Kind of like reminds me of Huntingdon. If you remember going to Huntingdon, some of you. But if you haven't been to Huntingdon, hopefully we'll go there again. Oh, getting blooming flies on me. But anyway, just bought my new shoes today. Just thought I'd show you that. <laughs> and it makes me feel a little bit more better on the feet. Not bad for twelve ninety nine, but they did offer a plastic bag for an extra twenty p or so. But I'll turn that down in the end because it costs extra, and I've got my own bag anyway. So this is the main high street, as you can see. It's a bit like Bears and Lemons, isn't it? <laughs> in a way, it's not far off, is it? It's got that Bears and Lemons feel. Look so far, I haven't had that many people looking at me weirdly which you do, do get in sometimes and i think other towns should come up with that sort of solution and a couple of cars do actually let you let you buy i suppose and i guess it's depending on the day and uh the sun is here that's not the newspaper by the way that's a green king we know that's a famous green king of bears and Evans. The old English pub here. I wonder if it's haunted. <laughs> That's a scary thought there. Make your own mind up. Make your own mind up about ghosts. Cromwell's as well. Wonder why it's got its name Cromwell. Is that because Cromwell come here or something like that? But of course, there's the Cromwell tourist information, which I did on a video. You can check out as well. So of course, yeah. Hello, if you are just switching on absolutely anywhere. It's only, as always, lovely coffee. Just throwing down the best footage that we possibly can give you here. I shouldn't be too far away from the spoons now. The Market Theatre. Long bar and... Oh, I'm here. This is it. <laughs> it's not too far away. <laughs> it's actually here. This is the actual spoons. <laughs> And I thought it was the Market Theatre, just here. So, yeah, I thought it was just down there. But, of course, there's something going on outside. But, yeah, it looks lovely, doesn't it? It's a courtyard out there. The Market Theatre and Box Office. I believe that's where the theatre is, just down here. Uh, so, yeah, I don't know if we can have a quick sneak through it. I'm not supposed to be around here, but, of course, I'll have a quick look. 
and I'm going to finish the live very shortly here. There is a courtyard here. It's called the Angel Vault Inn. I bet you're all screaming for me to go inside and show you inside, but of course, yeah. It looks like some sort of courtyard there. It's just a box office here. The theatre must be nearby. Yeah, there's a market party thing. So, yeah, it looks like a private car park here. Still can see the moon from here. Um, and, yeah, the courtyard is just out here. And, uh, yeah, I think we should have a quick sneak in. Okay. But there's a courtyard here. I'm not going to sit outside because I'm not supposed to. And you can see what it's like inside here. And you've got the kitchen area just there. Slightly different to the Drabba and the Regal. So let's have a little bit of a extra sneak in. There's some nice tables in there. Look. Here we go. Let's into a stranger. Oh, <laughs> that's nice. There you go. Ooh. That's private. Can't go in there. Oh, stairs. Stairs going up to the toilets again. <laughs> it's quiet down here and that's coming in and there we are it's quite nice in here fireplace in here if you really want to use it <laughs> so remember this is the angel vaults in oh. <laughs> looks good doesn't it oh, it's getting up these stairs isn't it I think there's another bit down here. There's a lift there if you need it. Oh, there's another bit here. So, yeah, I'm going to leave it at that. Um, oh, is there any offers? So, yeah, as I say, this is what you get here. There's plenty of space down here. The toilets are down here. <laughs> Again, some lovely pictures up here. You always get them on screens. Quickly show you. Another entry, like I showed you a minute ago. That's the main entry, just there. And I'm going to actually sit here, right out of the way of everything, I'm trying to look for a. Electric pump, electric plug, sorry. <laughs> this doesn't seem to be one around, does it? Can anyone help me? <laughs> I've got a battery booster anyway, so I'm going to leave it at that. Okay. There is no electric plug around here. <laughs> oh, it's quite nice and relaxing. <sighs> oh, dear. Don't I look exhausted after all that? So yeah, um, I am actually going to use my gimbal a little, uh, little bit later. <laughs> I'm exhausted by walking that far, but it's actually not too far if you think about it. It's about 45 minutes or so to the main town itself. I showed you that and I proved that very point. So yeah, I'm going to have my lovely coffee. And uh, yeah, it's hardly anyone around this area, but there's more people in the main bar as you well saw very quickly but yeah the toilets are upstairs so another place that is upstairs <laughs> but uh try and find the ladies <laughs> actually i'm more of a man uh, you know to find the man's toilets uh, the man's one yeah 
<laughs> but a lady would have to find a ladies one if you know what yeah. I'm saying so hopefully you can all join us at 6.30 when I finish up the stream I'm going to have my bike to eat now and I'll catch you all later ta-da from now live from Hitchin and if you're watching on Tori with us hit that subscriber button and hit that thumbs up loads and loads of times okay <laughs> and leave us a comment thank you very much for the lovely coffee we'll see you next time ta-da bye